Hello everyone, welcome to my channel ASP.NET Core and today I am going to show you the next video of Angular Movies and in this video tutorial just I am going to add uh, uh, actor image uh, so you can say that so here we have uh, a actor uh, form you know that a list of actors is displayed at here but uh, create a new actor right now here so just I am going to add image so image is actually it's a separate folder you can say so you can add a utility folder or directory inside the app uh, directory so first of all uh, create a new directory inside uh, app directory so here we have some uh, here we have a utility directory inside the uh, app directory now under the uh, utility folder just add a new component related to the image upload so here we have a new component first of all navigate to the utility folder src app now just go into the utility folder cd utility and under the utility just add a new uh, component nggc and the component name uh, you can take any name uh, which is related to the image so just I am taking image input okay so here we have img dash input skip test so just skip the test file and the component name is image input okay that's fine now in the image input dot uh, html file just you have to design uh, two things the first one is the button and the second one is the file in uh, file upload so here we have a button that is the type of is also a button control and just you can take material button so you can use mat raised button when we click on the button then you can say that that file upload control will be called so uh, the template reference variable I will use right now um, here for the file upload control and just I am going to uh, add the logic here when we click on the button then you can say that uh, the file upload uh, file upload input file is called by using template reference variable so just to take a template reference right now in the input type equals to file so here we have upload file so upload file dot click that is the function name you can take it here when we click on the select file that upload file will be called and also that will be called so just you can use change function right now at here you can use it okay when the change function right now you can use it here you can just send the event object and event object have a target inside the target we have some files and the files we have an array of the files you can select zero uh, index number of files and except also you can take it here that is the image the type of the file you can take it like image jpeg and image gif image png right like that so you can take it here instead of anything uh, like doc etc so here we have change function when we click on the button control that change function will be called also because the file will be changed and in which you can pass a dollar sign event the change function just write in the typescript file of the image input component and here we have change function with the event dot target dot files like that so event is the type of object so here we have you can say that first of all check if event dot target dot files dot length is greater than zero then that means of you can say the input file is selected okay so so you can take it uh, in the next section then you can say that uh, just pass the file uh, create a variable name is file the type of the file and the file just I want to pick only the zero paste index because just I want to take it only uh, uh, zero file so event dot target dot files dot 
uh, index of zero file okay so uh, so event dot target dot files of zero is passed to the file now that file have an object of the file that like the file name like the uh, size of the file etc so just convert that into the base 64 string so here I'm going to add any function in the TypeScript file. So just add inside the utility. Here we have a helper file.ts file and in which you can take it a function like export function function name to convert or you can say that anything you can take it here, anything you, uh, you consider name, anything you can take it here. So file colon of file and just I'm going to add a file reader to read the file and load the file and own error also just I'm going to uh, occurs here I'm using promise so written new promise just I'm going to use it here new promise and in the promise we have uh, two uh, uh, values you can say that is the resolve and reset in uh, the resolve is used where your file is successfully generated a simple uh, string values so here I'm using resolve and reset function inside it you can take it reader is the type of file reader so a constant reader equals to new file reader and you can say that reader dot read as data URL and what is the data URL it here inside the file okay so read as a data URL that is the file so read dot on load this time going to add a function that is on load it is a function and that function is used to resolve function because your file will be uploaded so resolve reader dot result okay that's fine now just I'm going to add on error after the inside the reject function so reader dot on error it's also a function and that function used by the reject in the promise so on error we have the error and inside it you can use reject and inside the reject just pass the error message okay so now after that that convert function will be used inside in image input TypeScript file here we have and just I'm going to get the string value by using the reader dot result so if you are using uh, promise then you can use then method as well as you can use catch method so here we have a convert is the type of the string okay just I'm going to use to convert it's a method name or you can say that it's a function name to convert inside it you can pass file or file it's a mm, dot then uh, if you are using resolve then you can then function will be called with the value value is type of the string and you can say that convert dot this dot convert inside in the this dot convert we can assign value Okay, so you can say uh, here we have this dot convert equals to value. So image convert, this time I'm going to pass it here because you know that both are the same um, right time right here. So it's automatically resolved. There is a no issue related to the that is the available on the same path you can say. So there is a no issue. So that code is enough and their code is fine. So 
so image convert colon string type so just now i am going to pass the value into the image convert now after that you can use inside it here you can take it here that is the image with the src binding so division right now here and i am going to add image div if statement if directory and here i am going to add image converter image convert and image with the src uploading src binding equals to image convert okay said so that's fine now here i'm going to add select file and here you can take any file from the computer and you can see that your file will be uploaded successfully and here we have that is the file okay now uh, that is the file of the actor create a new actor during this time now after that just i want to pass that uh, file into the parent form because input image is right now hit here just i am going to pass that image into the form okay so this is the child form value passed to the parent form so right now here i am using output decorator and uh, here I'm using image emit uh, it's a type of or you can say it's equals to new event emitter this time going to emit this image and image is where you can say in uh, image is just passed to the main form so image right now here I'm using file so image emit dot emit what is the Im emit that is the file this time going to pass okay so uh, in the event dot target dot files dot land here i'm using output decorator that is image emit this dot image emit dot emit function and inside the emit just pass the file okay everything is good now just you can use that is the second one Okay, so here I'm using that is the output function because just I'm going to pass that image inside in the output function image emit here I'm using file so selected image it's, it's a function name here I'm using dollar sign event so everything is fine now just I am request you Please subscribe my channel and uh, like this video and also press the bell icon. Don't forget, please subscribe my channel if you want to more project videos and if you want to project codes also. So just subscribe my channel and press the bell icon and uh, press the press hit also like button to like the video. So here we have date of birth similar just I'm going to add profile image or you can say that profile picture it's a type of the string inside in the form and you know that just uh, here i'm using uh, output function in the selected image so this dot form dot get profile in picture dot set value and what is the set value that is the image because inside the image we have only the path of the file
ओके सो दैट्स फाइन नाउ एवरीथिंग इज फाइन इन द एडिट फंक्शन आल्सो so thank you guys for watching this video and keep watching all other videos which is related to angular movies project and here i'm using uh, api also in asp.net core thank you very much for watching this video